everyone, it's Amy Sherman from MLive and Behind the Mitten, and I'm here at the MLive uh, Hub, downtown Grand Rapids, where we're having an exciting morning. Uh, power went out, so everybody is kind of wigging out because uh, we don't know what to do. Fire trucks are out front, I think most of downtown is actually out of power this morning, uh, but I'm sure they're working on it, so we'll have some uh, some light soon, I hope. But while we wait, I'm lucky enough to get to sit here and visit with Chef Andy from Fustini's Olive Oil. Uh, you guys have several locations around the state, five locations. That's actually, correct, five locations state. around the state. Right? Tell me where they are again. We're based in Traverse City, mm -hmm. Holland is the closest to Grand Rapids, Ann Arbor, Petoskey, and Boyne City. I love that. And you guys have been around now for a while. I think a lot of people are very familiar with your Nine products. years now in the in the, uh, in the uh, Traverse City store. That's Congratulations. Yeah. And that's your flagship store. That is our flagship store. It's where the owner lives, and he. Uh, that's our largest store. So people who are not familiar with Bustini's, tell them what you guys are all about. We are all about tasting oil and vinegar. We call ourselves a tasting room. We want you to taste yeah. our products. You come to the store and you walk up to the little stainless steel dispensers and you pour yourself a taste. So I love this. This is one of my favorite things to do when, um, when I'm in a, in a, in yeah. a city. I always go into the olive oil store because there's a few. Um, the Fustinis are here, but when I was in Asheville, North Carolina, mm -hmm. we, went to, we went on a tour, a foodie tour, and we actually went to an olive oil store nice. where I proceeded to drink probably a gallon of olive oil, <laughs> uh, which my body didn't appreciate the next day. But mm -hmm. I love it because you um, not only do you guys have flavored olive oils, but you also have just classic extra virgin olive oil. Just that, extra virgin olive oil. And, and we, we follow the the, uh, the hemispheres right so now we're into the southern hemispheres mm. and the northern hemisphere oils have been harvested and we'll see those here in another yeah. month so truly or two. a seasonal, a seasonal it is. product is you know the fresher the olive oil the better it's going to be that's right well right. The, and if people are unfamiliar with trying those extra virgin olive oils i mean the flavor profiles are it's incredibly unbelievable. different yeah in my mind of an extra virgin olive oil really has three flavor characteristics to it. It has a pepperiness, a grassiness, and a creaminess, right? And they, they rate olive oils by, by flavor, mild, medium, and robust. So a robust oil has lots of grass and lots of pepper and a little bit of creaminess. And a mild olive oil is going to have lots of creaminess with a little pepper and a little bit of grass. I love that. Well, one of the questions I got a lot when I was teaching cooking classes was what type of oil should I be cooking with and can I cook with extra virgin olive oil? So why don't you tell people your take? Well, you can cook with extra virgin olive oil. You can saute with extra virgin olive oil. The, the smoke point of extra virgin olive oil is a little higher than butter. So anything that you would you would saute in butter or cook in butter, you can cook in extra virgin olive oil. Now, you wouldn't want to deep fry, right? So the smoke point is 320 <laughs> degrees. You deep fry between 350 and 375, you're not going to want to use extra virgin olive oil. In fact, if you use the extra virgin olive oil to deep fry, you're going to lose all the health benefits of that oil. And a lot of the flavor. And that's one of the that's things correct. about like olive oils like what you guys have. These, I love these because I look at them more as they're really truly a part of the dish in the sense of flavoring they the are. dish, finishing the dish, um, adding a lot of complexity to it. I think the best value in terms of flavor, the best bang for the buck is an extra virgin olive oil because you can, if you saw Saute with it, that pepperiness, that grassiness comes through. And if you use it as a as a salad dressing, that creaminess and that that just it, it's, oh, it's it brings out stop all it, that stop, flavor. Stop, stop. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's fantastic stuff. Well, one of the other things uh, that Fustini's offers at uh, four of your locations is you actually have a cooking school, and this would be a fantastic gift for the holidays, is to give someone a certificate to go take a class. It's a fantastic event. You can you get inspired, you'll be educated. Uh, you, you come in, you'll be, show, be shown uh, knife skills and equipment skills and how to use the products in unique ways. Very cool. And, and that's an active gift, which I always think is uh, kind of interesting for Christmas for those foodies in your life. Now, you can also uh, order a lot of your product, all of your product, and have it shipped around the country that's so people correct. can get a little taste of what you have going on here in Michigan. www.fustinis.com. And you have different packages, some that are already created for you and some that you can do custom, right? That's correct. You can customize. You can put a, a dipping dish or a mustard or a tapenade or a pasta. You can put together baskets of... Uh, wood baskets, or even just a four-piece sampler, or two-piece sampler. And it looks like various you have sizes. Cookbooks too. We have we have five different cookbooks that you can that you can pick from. The uh, one on top is the holiday book. It's been a very popular book for this this season. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, well, I really want to drink some olive oil right now. No, I'm you want, we're well, you want to open one? That'd no, be no, fine no. by me. <laughs> Actually, yes, I did I did bring you a treat today. I brought What's you some that? candied pecans. Oh, that's terrible. So those terrible. are pecans that are that are. Uh, uh, Toasted and then I take an egg white mm -hmm. and add some 18 year balsamic vinegar to it. That egg is an emulsifier. 
So it takes on all that flavor and makes it its own. Then you then you coat the pecans and the egg white, toss them in a little cinnamon sugar, and bake them in the oven for about 10 minutes. Oh my god, that sounds fantastic. And, and this sounds like something you might get to learn in one of your classes at Tuesday. It would be something. That'd be something simple right. that you would get. We offer classes anything from simple to advanced. I like that. You have both demo and hands on. That's correct. That's correct. All right, I love it. Well, so many options for a great Michigan holiday gift from Fustini's. Uh, check them out, five locations across the state. Let's see if I get them right. Uh, Traverse City, yep. Boyne City, Holland, Ann Arbor, and I'm missing one. Petoskey. Petoskey, thank you. <laughs> but you can also check them out online at? At Fustini's.com. <laughs> so you can order gifts or maybe get a gift certificate uh, for one of their great cooking classes. Check them out, Fustini's.com, great olive oil and vinegar.